So there are various types of, there are two main types of IP addresses. And the two main types, the first one is what we refer to as an IPv4 address. And so normally, um, for those who have at least done a little bit of, um, say, networking, you, you might have come across an IP address in this structure. So the IPv4 address, so something like this on your computer. So maybe most of you may have something like 192.168.1.1 so or something. A quick check on my machine. So if I just do a quick one on my laptop and I do maybe an IP config, it's telling me that um, even though I have lots of IP addresses on my screen, it's telling me that my IP address is 192.168.1.100. And that is what we refer to as an IPv4 address. So an IPv4 address, if we look down here, I'm saying an IPv4 address is made up of 32 bits. The question is, what's 32 bits? Let's just forget about IPv6 and let's just focus on IPv4. So typically, any IPv4 address would have a maximum of four numbers. So four numbers. And so basically, the four numbers that we're talking about, we're talking about here, um, if I just go back to the first IP address I have here. So there's a number here and you could see that it's separated by a dot and there's another number here and there's a third number and there's a fourth number. So these are four different numbers when it comes to the IPv4 addresses. Now, each number is made up of what we call eight bits. And I'll explain that very soon. So this is, assuming this is eight bits, let's just say, each number is eight bits. So if each number is eight bits, so this is another eight bits. This is another eight bits. And this is another eight bits. And so eight plus eight plus eight plus eight will give us 32. So that's why we're saying that every IPv4 address is um, 32 bits long. Now, why do I say each number is eight bits? So before we go into that, particular one, we need to understand that every IPv4 address has only four numbers and for each number it can range from zero to 255. So basically what I mean is this. So if it has only four numbers, two, three, four. So these four numbers can be from zero to 255, zero to 200. So there's a dot here, zero to 255. 0 to 255, 0 to 255. So there's a dot here. So if I pick any number random from here, I'll say maybe 10 dots. And I pick any number between this range, maybe 200. I pick any number here from this range, I'll say one. And I pick any number here from this range, I say maybe four. So clearly this is an IPv4 address. It has four numbers. And between two numbers, there is a dot. And so this is at least the four numbers I'm referring to. If we look closely, we realize that each number can be only between 0 to 255. And this is where that 8 bits concept comes in. And so we're going to explain what the 8 bits mean. 